Right, that's the rail um, ground out. There was that little point there where the uh, cocking uh, fletch was hitting. That's not an out. And then down this end, that's smooth now. And as you can see, there's um, a few holes, but I don't know if it's going to affect the strength. Uh, that hole there is obviously where the uh, front sight bolt goes through, but there's still enough thickness there. There's no effect on the strength there. And that's got like a big gaping hole. But if you look underside, you can see um, where I ground it down to allow that flesh to go through. What you've got to remember is that the prod or the, the limb, all the pressure is this, is here. So it's force against here. Um, there's enough meat left on there that's not going to affect the structure or the integrity of the, the front end. So yeah, all in all, I'm quite pleased with how this turned out. Um, I had a few burrs and stuff along the rail, so just polished that out. I won't bother painting it because I only just scratch off. Um, I'll just leave it. I might even polish it, make it uh, high gloss. So yeah, that's worked pretty well. Next part of the mod is uh, the trigger. This is the original um, trigger um, for plastic. It's not bad actually. There's no sign of wear on it. Um, I'm just going to make a metal one just because I've not seen one before. I'm going to use this 5mm um, engineering grade aluminium. So it's very strong, very light. And I'm just going to pop that on there, trace around it, cut it out with an angle grinder and then use uh, a Dremel just to get these um, fine sort of cuts in around it. This little uh, sticky out nodule part here holds a spring. So this little spring here. Um, so the idea is that the, the bowstring itself isn't held um, by the trigger. So there's no uh, stress, no pressure on the trigger at all. The strings held behind the rail and when you pull the trigger, it just pushes the bowstring off the rail and it fires. Um, this spring, all that does is when you pull the trigger, it just resets it. It just pushes straight back, straight with the rail. Um, so, uh, yeah, pretty straightforward. And uh, we'll see how we get along with that.